Oh, he's in. He's in. My turn. Hey, there we go. Get in. Just about got there. Yep. Yes, ladies and gents, welcome back to the Film Football Channel. It's time for another backstage vlog. Today, we are headed back to Meadow Park. We're here at Meadow Park, even. For the first time in two years, last time we was here, it's a ball we took on Chesterfield uh, two years ago nationally. But I'm joined by a very special guest today. He's never been on the channel. Hello. It's Jake. It's Jake. Jake. Come How on, then, Jake. How are we doing? You don't go to many football games, do you? Not really. But Not really. based on what I've told you on the train down, what do you think the score's going to be today? I reckon. Three one. Three one Bournemouth. Bournemouth. He's gone three one Bournemouth. Yeah, yeah. And Bournemouth need the points today because they are stuck in the bottom four. They take on Wheelstone, or Wheelstone, how you say it, who are not in the bottom four, but they are above it by three points. Well, they're above Bournemouth by three points. So Bournemouth win today. They're on level points with them. So, it, you know, if Wheelstone win, they're clear. But if Bournemouth win, then they have their chance to stay safe. And there's not many games to go for Bournemouth. We've only got about four games. I'm not sure about Wizard. They might have five. But it's a huge game for both sides. Really, really important that both sides get some points today. We're next to the atmosphere. There's a drum there. So hopefully, hopefully, uh, this stand is packed out later on. Because this, like I said, is a huge game. So it's about 45 minutes to kick off. We're in the ground. We're early. Ready to see some football. See your kick off. I'm not saying my score prediction. You know, I'm going to have to say, uh, I'm going to have to go down the middle, I'm going to have to say 1-1. I know, sitting on the fence and all that, but I don't know much about Willstone. Bournemouth, they were picking up points, the odd win, the odd draw, but they just haven't been able to pick up results recently. I, mean, I think they're five on the bounce in terms of defeats. So I just don't think they will have enough to claim the win. I think they'll get a point. I think they'll get a point, but nothing more. I hope they prove me wrong though. I hope Bournemouth can get the win, but we'll see what happens. taking all three or one each today. Five minutes in, they've got the better side ball and work. They're on course. 
Plenty of time to go, of course. Samanga bundles it over. Puts Vaughan with in front. Can they push for more? Listen to the noise. Steady up that defence. Keeping. Pretty, pretty shocking. Only positive is it's not one nil. Is it? Well, sorry. The only positive is it's not more than one nil. They've certainly had a few chances to equalise, haven't taken them. But with Bournemouth not taking their chances, will that one chance come for Wilson and will they take it? As it stands at the moment, in this huge relegation clash, it's Bournemouth one, Wilson two. Nathan 
Bournemouth and Ashford, what a save! This is exactly what I was saying though, about Bournemouth needed to take those chances in the first half. Straight away in the second half, Wheelstone looked really, really good coming forward. I was thinking it could haunt them, it hasn't yet, but it's looking like it could. Oh, okay. Yes! Oh! Oh, and again a good save! One with Brighton again! Couldn't have said it better myself. Supporters that have taken the time and trouble to be here this afternoon. There it is, Bournemouth 
secure a huge, huge three points on their road to safety. Four excellent goals. And they sentenced Willstone to a huge defeat. So they are now level on points with Willstone in the league. They are still in the bottom four. But they've, like I said, when they scored that second, third and fourth goal, they have given themselves a huge stepping stone to get out and stay in the National League for yet another season. Excellent performance from Boreham Wood. But for Willstone, it's something they need to work on. Pick themselves up, dust themselves down and go again next week. Commiserations to those travelling fans down there. 4-0. Poor showing from them, but fair play to every single one of them who stayed till the end. Excellent support. Best luck to the rest of the season and next season. Um, no matter what happens, I'm sure they will be there. And I'm sure these Bournemouth fans will be there as well, even if they are not to stay up. But for now, it's three points. Luke Carrod on his farewell tour of, of the National League after he was announced that he will be stepping down at the end of the season. Gives his baseball fans a huge three points. Boreham Wood on the road to safety. Full time here at Meadow Park. Boreham Wood 4, Wheelstone 0. Right the ladies and gents, nearly back. Not quite, got to do a changeover. So we're at the station. But Jake, so that was your first football game in a good few years, mate. 4 0. Give, yeah, give us your thoughts on that game. then. Didn't expect it to go that well, to be quite honest with you. I thought, rough first half, rough first half. You know, pulled it through. One nil at the start. It was looking a bit ropey, but after the, after half time, we pulled, pulled it out through. Of the bag, pulled out the bag. There and you we go, fucking mate. Smashed it. Yeah, well, like, yeah. I mean, well said. Like four, like four nil is is deserved in my opinion. I think Willstone were pretty awful, um, but Boreham Wood, how it wasn't four nil at least in the first half. I don't know, but uh, they got there in the end. They secured all three points, and they are heading for safety as it stands in the National League, so full credit to Bournemouth, but again, like I said, unlucky to Willstone, it wasn't their day today, move on to the next one, there is still time for them to save themselves, pick themselves up, dust themselves down, get on with the next one, but yeah, like I said, Bournemouth on course of staying up, they're looking good, thank you so much for watching everyone, um, if you haven't already, please subscribe, we're on the road to a thousand subscribers, so if you could do that, that would be absolutely amazing, and uh, yeah, I will see you tomorrow, because tomorrow it is the EFL Trophy Final, Peterborough United take on Wickham Wanderers. Big game at Wembley. So I'll see you there for that one. Have a brilliant rest of your evening, ladies and gents.